Namaste. For this short class, let's awaken the brain and correct postural imbalances. The elements are intermediate but could easily be modified through the utilization of the block or make the range of motion smaller. Starting standing. Yeah. Yeah. Feeling your legs engage. You can do that by spreading the toes. You may lift them and just shifting the weight of the body towards the balls of the feet and down the heels. Yeah. And then find a moment of stillness. Beautiful. All right. Lifting the right knee up. And then soften the left leg, bending that left leg. And just easy arms. In here, let me angle. So your torso or your body is slightly leaning forward and the knee is bent. Yeah, the front knee is bent too. Good. So you're shifting your weight down the strongest part of your body, which is the abs. Uh, and then here with the knees bent, and you engage the thighs. And this is a balancing posture. You develop your concentration too. Mm -hmm. And here, hands to your chest. Yeah. And then feeling the thigh, yeah, especially the, your bottom leg engage. And the glute heels. And this is light. Yeah. Beautiful. All right, from there, tipping forward. So your right foot steps up, yeah, shifting the weight, yeah, lifting the left leg up. Yeah. And here you don't have to go really deep, yeah, just some mouth suspension. Yeah. And then bit by bit, progressively, come deeper to the horizontal axis. Mm -hmm. Open the arms wide and then balancing, just relax your eye gaze down the floor. Yeah. Stay. Make sure you're breathing. Don't lock your right leg, soften that knee too, but not as deep as the first. Alright, we're gonna spring that left knee up, inhaling. Beautiful. And then from there, we're lunging backwards. So inhale, let's just shift forward and the fingers catch the floor. And you lift forward, lunges back and stay. Settle the breath. All right, the right hand or the left hand pressing under the shoulder. Yeah, circular to the right hand side, breathing in. All right, and then right hand down. All right, stretch the hips high. And here, stretch the legs by slightening the heels. Right. The left leg lifts behind us, the three-legged dog, inhaling, and then here, shoulders over the hands, and then tucking, so the left knee to your chest, and then do it again, inhale, lengthen, exhale to the front. All right. Do this two more times. Right. Next time, we're stepping, yeah, the left foot through, inside the wrist, yes, yeah, so the hips are level, engage the back thigh. Right. Remain, and we're lifting our bodies up to the high lunge position, breathing in, rise it up, and you exhale, soften, All right, we're twisting, shift the body forward, yeah, so the left, oh, right elbow hooks across, yeah. yeah, palms together, and then just take a mouth twist, if this is difficult for your low back, place your right hand under the shoulder, and left arm wraps around the low back, if you need to modify, you have supported block work, and a mouth twist instead. Yeah. Breathe. Stay. Good. All right, hands to the floor. Just soften lightly. Loosen. All right, the right hand now is under. Shifting. Yeah. Side press. Hand down. All right, inhale the right leg up. All right, stepping through. Right foot. Yeah. Good. Exhale, easing here. Soften. Good. And we're stepping that left foot forward, half only. And then from here, we're going to rise. Good. Inhale, exhale, sink your right hip. And bend the right knee. So we're just changing sides. There are hands to your chest. Yeah, torso slightly forward. 
bending deeper like you're a statue stay through the nose to inhale exhale nose Good. arms wide yeah. play around this position yeah you may fold the elbows you may keep your hands to your chest yeah you can lift the arms a bit ahead but the structure yeah the basic technique so the hips are supporting us and are standing like so all right you prepare all right tipping forward lift foot yeah, inhaling, yeah, side body long, wide arms maybe, and suspend. Yeah. So make sure your spine is open, so breathe direct. Yeah. Your standing leg, left leg still, slightly bent, but not as deep. And then bit by bit, come deep. Right. And then many things you can do with the hands. You can clasp them. Well, you can extend it forward depending on your preference and your level or you can just keep your hands to your chest yeah, for a gentler alternative right ready for the leg balance right knee lifts up inhaling stay all right prepare to lunge stepping right foot backwards good settle the breath right hand becomes the foundation yeah. and circle over inhaling if you need to modify this you can place your top foot front yeah. All right. hand down pivoting the downward facing dog right leg left so behind this be like a dog inhaling all right exhale yeah. inhale stretch exhale to the front inhale lengthen good one more all right prepare right foot inching forward it may just go one half step take another one with the hand all right stay all right rise up on your heart inhale lunging and exhale all right forward the trunk all right prepare the twist elbow hand you can wrap if you're ready you can do the full one with your bottom hand down you can even stretch your top arm over here but don't rush yeah it's a short practice it's not meant to you know be done so deeply yeah just to awaken the muscles awaken the brain yeah and then open the joints prepare to release yeah lift hand is under one circular to the right hand side inhalation hand down prepare to lift leg up inhale all right stepping through stay all right and the right foot steps forward and the feet together good sitting the hips low to the squat position inhaling and stay with the squat position folding the elbows like cactus inhale straighten exhale soften now breathing in breathing out let's do two more inhalation exhalation breathing in ready to fold exhale as the floor okay. step into the back work legs now we're facing all pedal legs breathe all right forward your torso with the hands together with your knees hugging to your chest one at a time hover and then sitting yeah on your heels breathe in here while you're practicing your breath awareness you can massage the knees yeah circle the shoulders around if this is difficult yeah yeah you may use the prop the block yeah sitting on it yeah so it's lighter for the knees yeah so anything you can find at home yeah to support your helps yeah it could be a stack of books could be a timber yeah it could be a pillow yeah yeah. This one is good for opening the knee joint, especially if you're working at home, you're sitting for prolonged periods of time, it's bad. Uh, so make sure you take you know, periodic breaks, yeah. you don't have to go yeah, 
So deeply into your practice, just basic movements will suffice. Yeah. Good. From there, release. Yeah. And sitting. Yeah. Stretch your legs in the front. And then give your legs some gentle rubbing. Yeah. Knees, the calves. Yeah. And then you might shake the leg. Yeah. Since our practice, but leg balancing. So decompress the joints. But, and then crossing legs. Good. And scalp. And then rest. You can do this practice anytime. It could be yeah, your morning practice before you work, or it could be a work break practice, morning tea, your lunch time, afternoon, or even after you work, or anytime you need for it. Yeah? Inhale, arms left over the hip. And exhale, soften. Yeah, breathing in, rise the body up. You may lighten the knees, suspend lightly up. And hands together, exhale in front of the heart, so our hips low. Namaste to you. Good. Have a productive day, and I'll see you in the next lesson. Enjoy.